Good morrow, viewers of the YouTube in kind. Welcome to another episode of The Binding of Isaac, Wrath of the Lamb Edition version 1.48. My name is R The Western Lynx, and yeah, let's uh, get started. Uh, we got to the Utero last time, unlocked Kane, we've also unlocked Maggie so far. So we've got a suite of three players to play as, but at the moment I'm just gonna stick with what we all know and love, which is Isaac. Uh, because I believe that Isaac is a pretty cool dude, in my personal opinion. Let's hope this is a good pill. Uh, bombs are key. Hmm. Kind of the complete opposite of anything that I could have possibly wanted uh, in pill form. Umbilical cord. The only reason, just give me a second, I've got to turn down my sound on my headset. Because my ears are just being. My eardrums are just being popped by pure Isaac sounder. This is attack fly. Uh, yeah, I was right. Damn it, I never get that right. I always uh, mess up attack fly with the mulligan. So that's surprising to get right. And people have been saying that my videos are. Uh, well, one guy. Uh, yo, dude. Thanks for commenting. Uh, like I said, I think I do love constructive criticism. And uh, you said that the videos are too long. Here's what I'm going to do. Binding of I Isaac videos, they're going to be just full runs. Uh, no stopping. No starting. Just complete full runs until I die. However, videos now such as my Warfare Let's Play playthrough are going to attack while you actually stop so that you didn't hit him. That's just stupid. Uh, videos like my Walker playthrough are going to be um, split into 10 minute segments now. So, I hope you appreciate that, uh, sir, and I also agree with you, I think that having a 40 minute video and asking someone to watch down, sit down and watch it even, uh, is a little bit too much to ask, and that was some really stupid damage just there, I'm surprised that I fell into that trap. So yeah, like I say, thanks for the constructive criticism, that is always appreciated, and I will, I will always love constructive criticism, I'll just be like, hey man. Thanks for the constructive criticism, by the way. Also, seven subscribers in the first day. I'd like to thank you guys that have subscribed. Oh, great. Get me a, get me a range upgrade. That's that's just what I wanted. I've always wanted a range upgrade in the form of shoes. But yeah, seven subscribers at the point of recording, which is the 19th of August, around 20 past three in the afternoon. This particular video won't be uploaded until the 20th of August because I'm already sitting on footage. That's right. <laughs> it didn't take long. I play a lot of video games. I record a lot of video games. Uh, this is it's feeling like what I was born to do already. And people, you're saying that I'm like uh, in, oh geez, in comments on my video and on my videos and channel. People saying that I'm destined to be famous. Thank you. <laughs> and, uh, many games of League without me. I'm super busy ATM. Right here then. How long is it? Now that that's out of the way, that's annoying. I didn't want you guys to have to see my Steam friend. Not cool, bro. It's, oh, damn it. Bad damage already. Again. Constantly. Bad damage. Do you guys want to play League of Legends with me sometime? Just. Oh my god. Just hit up, hit me up. Uh, if you, in fact, if you ever want to play any sort of video game, hit me up on YouTube. And I'll be straight on your face. I'll be like, yo, you want to play with me? That's awesome. I want to play with you too. You sound like a Peter. You wanna play with me? Well, guess what? I'm gonna play with you. Hell yeah. It's mutual consent. It's not rape if you want it. Wait, what? Really weird strains of uh, commentary when I play this game, I have to say. Uh, also, remember I said that I was... I had ideas for uh, the games that I wanna play? But that... That... I've uh, downloaded, like, two more indie games. But I think it's uh, only good to be doing... Uh, like two series at a time, so I'm gonna get through Walker and wow, it's a heck of a lot of money. I'm gonna get through Walker. And I'm also gonna uh, continue this Money Wise series. Uh, two really bad items from Boss Room, from uh, Item Room. So let's see if there's something there in the shop that I can buy for cheaps. No. 
But if I get three coins, I will definitely be coming back here. If I survive, because I've had no health upgrades, no damage upgrades, <laughs> not really many upgrades of much, just an attack fly and some range. Tell that troll engine is in full effect at the moment. Uh, so two hits from anything really, and it's, it's game over. So. Oh dear. Could very feasibly in my my terrible Isaac play, because I am nowhere near the best player of Isaac in the world. In fact, I'm one of the worst players of Isaac in the world, I would say. My dodging skills, I would say it'd be very, very easy for this to be the end. Okay, just need two more coins to see the play. Okay, we'll open the poop. We won't fight the boss either. Great! Uh, sorry, what was that about not fighting bosses? I, I never said anything of the sort. In fact, we got homing bombs. Let's use them for the full effect against Super NG here. Maybe that's not the best thing to do, actually. Thinking about it. Well, ah, uh, what the heck? When? When did I get little speed? What? What? Do any of you guys remember me picking up little Steven? Because I'm pretty sure that I never picked up little Steven. If we survive this room and he stays with us, then... Things have gone from weird to weird here. Maybe it was because I get hit, got hit by Super I don't know. And I don't... I'm weird, 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 weird. I don't know how I feel about this. If it's... Little Steven! Where'd you come from, buddy? Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? Cut and I Joe. Where did you come from? Where did you go? Where did you come from? Cut and I Joe. I just realized what a precarious situation I'm in at the moment. Oh, yeah. Well, we'll we'll replay. I think it going to the basement part two and just leaving it there would be kind of shit. Ah, good. Immediately doing better because we've got a tent to drop off the bat and I haven't been stupid enough or unlucky enough to use a uh, Bonzar key pill. Blow this tent drop out. Hopefully get the spider. Yes, we do. One spirit heart better than no spirit heart, so I always say. Oh, great, we've got gluttony. Easier than Super Envy? Yes, I would say so. I would most definitely say that fighting again strange creature that pops his stomach open to fire lasers at me. It's a much better choice than a strange creature that splits itself every time I kill part of it with my ears. This game is very strange. <laughs> Unfortunately, it didn't give me any noticeable upgrades. Because uh, sometimes Super Envy can give you some pretty goddamn good... Okay, that was a weird accent that just happened there. I apologize for all the missing but... Okay, this is not a good place for me to be. Okay. Spider, how did you do that? That was spider section. Okay. Stump found our our secret, not secret room. Our treasure room. So let's just go down to any place it can be. And there it is, that's probably. Hopefully we won't take any more spider damage. Spiders. Spiders are He's coming out of the wazoo, but oh, technology too! I probably couldn't have asked for anything better. Oh, got a message on my phone. Uh, we've got a new subscriber there. Make that eight subs subscribers now. I got, I get all of my subs and comments and stuff from the right through in my library. So uh, I know when people sub, people leave comments. Don't know when people like and dislike the video though. But hey, but, yeah, I make that eight subs now. Cool. We racked up ten subscribers before. Uh, the upload of this video, I would be the happiest bro on the planet. And look at the way that the laser just cuts right through Pete. I mean, it's not Pete. This is, uh... Pin! Pin! Look at the way... Uh, this is like the easiest part as well. Looks like my luck is returning to me now. The way that my laser just slices right through him like it was a... 
piece of olive shape, multiple olives connected together. I don't know. What could you call What could you say that's not like? I don't know. A tears upgrade and a tarot card. The f which is the fool, which is terrible. It's a terrible tarot card. It takes you right back to the spawn point. Hmm. Definitely not sure how I feel about these I this uh that upgrade. I know that the technology too is just brilliant. Let's just say if I got the mulligan now, I'd be the most unstoppable force of flies this side of the UK. Apart from maybe the rubbish dump down the road, because that place has a hell of a lot of flies. These are also some of my least favorite enemies in the game. Always seem to get damaged by them in some form or another. Not that there is more than one of the damage one in a form that intensely hurts you. I I did. I was I was thinking about that one. And I looked at my heart container as well, so I was like, whoa. I'm still really confused about where little Steven came from. That was kind of weird. Yeah, it's a lot better run though, already. Technology 2 is just one of my favorite items, and if I... Oh, Jesus, no, that was not good. I think I've, I think I've got it. I did. That was really lucky. You know what? I will pick this up and no. I was I was sincerely debating on whether I should take on the uh, boss, but I don't think it'd be clever. Oh great, one of my least favorite rim layouts for the cellar. I can tell you that. Come on, just spider, cooperate with me here. Spider, please. That's the best cooperation I'm going to get from you. Okay, I'm going to have to really quickly zip around there. And this is the hardest part of this room, in my opinion. There we go. Simples. Ugh. I really want to go and ask off that class room. Uh, best friend. Not my favorite. Not my favourite. It explodes and but also draws the enemy to them. One time, a long time ago, before I reset my stats, best friend was something that ended my run. It was not a happy day. I've used it on the mum boss fight. Mum put her foot down really quickly. Best friend blew up in my face. And so we've got Duke of Flies. Yeah. I'm not really sure how useful best friend is going to be against Duke of Flies. Use the him there. Totally missed you flies entirely. So that that's cool. That's absolutely fine because <clears throat> sorry about that. A little something caught in my throat. The uh, technology too, or either of the technology I have, probably one of the best counters to you flies. And the sucky thing is, due to the fact that we've got those two spirit heart, the eternal uh, hearts. It's gonna make me have two. It's gonna make me only have one HP upgrade, whereas I could have had two if they'd been on separate floors. So it's kind of a little bit sucky. Oh, and the cave's part one now. So yeah, let's just use the full card so I don't have it anymore. Considering the fact that I find it a completely useless item that has. Oh damn it! A completely useless item that. Is completely useless. What more do you want? You know what? I I have faith in the fact that if I use this blood bank, I will it will pay out, and I will get another health upgrade. I have faith in that. Due to that fact, I'm just gonna abuse it. It's also gonna give me enough money to go to the shop, which is a good thing. I'm actually gonna use it right down. Probably the stupidest thing you've ever seen anyone do on this game. One more, oh, come on, baby, pay out. Nope. 
Well, it gave me a heck of a lot of money. And I will most definitely use it to buy both the compass, the spirit art, you know what? The moon card, that will take you to a secret room. See, that pro Isaac knowledge that I have obtained through my decades playing Isaac. Not that you, not that Isaac has been out for more than 10 years. If it had, it was very good for its time. Okay. This room is pretty easy, although it can be rather deadly also. I would also like to get my health back up a little bit. In fact, I would just like some health so that I can use and abuse the Thingy. Oh crap, this could be the end. This could be the beginning of the end. In fact, no, I'd say the beginning of the end was when I started to use and abuse the uh, blood bank. I'd say that was the beginning of the end. So this could be the end. Yeah, if you understood that strain of commentary, you're a complete and utter genius, I have to say. But yeah, what I'd like from here is either some form of way of me getting full health, really thought that could have been my own demise there. I was rather lucky. Okay, the mulligan. No, Halo of Flies. Damn. That would have been amazing. See, look, I always get the fly items mixed up. I was desperately hoping for that to be the mulligan. I'm like a complete and utter fool. Because I'm, I'm feeling, I'm feeling risky. I feel like, I feel like doing risky things at the moment. No. doing many favors at the moment because I've put myself in a very very dangerous position with only two and a half spirit hearts and half of a normal heart very precarious but if I can keep my dodging up the par like I have been doing on the past couple of runs then all shall be Fly, I can't, I can't actually hit you. Could you please stop being such a douche? Okay, there we go. Good spot there. Thank you. And yeah, I will definitely use a single bomb to get to that coin and chest. The tick. Tempting as it is, I think I'll give it a miss. And I do not like this run. At all. Oh, wow, Greedhead. You've got... Pro jumping skills there, buddy. I'm really unsure of how you managed to do that. But hey, the fact that you did actually made this room slightly easier, I think. People may tend to disagree with that. But then I would say that your opinion is wrong. Hmm. Surely this great head has got barely any health left. Barely any help. There we go. And nothing. From no drops. Well, it looks like we're gonna fight the boss and probably die. Unless it's an easy one. Oh, the hut. Yeah, that's an easy boss. Yeah. Pretty much Duke of Flies. Again. And this time, best friend looks like he's gonna do some damage. Oh my god. Speaking of damage. God. Just totally rethunk my ideas of best friend. He just helped me out big time, uh, pageant boy. Best of items in the world, but we have got to deal with the devil. Nine lives. Guppy's paw. Mm, both items that I'm not a fan of, I'm afraid. Mainly not a fan of nine lives at the moment, because it's going to take me right back down to one heart, and after all of the death the work I've done trying to get this blood bag, which I will get. I'm not giving up on this blood bag just yet. This blood bag will be mine. Ah. Give me an IV bag, I'm gonna be... In fact, if you either give me an IV bag or nothing, I'm gonna be angry. I will be back for you, you sexy little mother. Trucker. Wow, I, I am 
I look really messed up. I've got a fetus hanging out the side of my face. I've got a crown on this flies flying around me. Oh my god, what is it with these greed heads? What do you want from me? I to die. I don't want to die. My life, my life. Wow. Oh no, get out of there. It's not the first time I've had that said to me. Am I dodging though? Rather good, I must say. I mean, look at that. Let's just keep on this full run dodging here. Okay, that was sort of inevitable. I now have a spirit heart and a heart, and half a red heart. High risk, no reward at the moment. That's the sort of game that we're playing because there's no way that I can win. At this moment in time. At all. Ah, thanks, a bomb. Something that I couldn't possibly need at this moment in time. But I would really, really, you know what I'd love? Red hearts. I think, I think that'd be good. Alright, this is a relatively easy run. Have I spoken too soon? No, no, not at the moment, I haven't. Oh, if that deal with the devil run would give me like a brimstone or something, that would have been just incredible. I've got no idea how good Brimstone is. Oh, thank you! Now, if this is that heart room, I am set. And I could really do some damage upgrades, actually, from my bosses and stuff, or anything. Uh, the damage I'm doing at the moment is absolutely appalling. Absolutely ridiculous. Right, let's be hopeful. Well better than nothing. Looks like we are gonna actually going to have to leave that board bank. As much as I do not want to. Considering how much I have played the poopy out of it. I genuinely thought that it would uh, help me out. But hey. Looks like fate was not kind. Oh yeah, that is just a tick. You're such a tick. Yeah, I'm definitely going to avoid the tick at the moment, this moment in time. If I had uh, Mother's Purse or whatever it is, I'd definitely be using it. Okay, so we'll go right first. See, if we had full health, we'd be doing pretty damn good in respect to health. But we don't, and we're not. Is there any health there? Oh, great. A coin that I don't need. And a bomb that I kinda, but still don't really need. And this is a room where I am almost certainly going to take damage. Remember, I say almost. However, the certainly was more prevalent. Unfortunately. You know what, best friend? Prop you. Wow, what the? Wow! What the heck just happened? See, that's one of the reasons that I don't like the best plan. Because the, the enemies in the room literally just chucked him at my face. They were like, oh, best friend, huh? I, think, I think I'm going to use your own attack against you. That's not cool. I just, like, totally blew my chances of maybe even getting off of this room. No, not this room, this floor. Great, more, more coins. Thanks a bunch. I've got 33. What could I possibly need more coins for? Hello, Larry Jr. I'm not in the mood for your crap right now, buddy. Heart, please, no. More coins. Thank you. That's what I asked. Telepathy for dummies. You can... You can go poop on yourself. I don't, I don't want you. But... I want to use every single item I come across because I want to get to Platinum God as quickly as possible. And you know what? We're just going to go down here. Oh, well, thanks for watching, guys. This is obviously going to be the end of the run. Oh, he's best friend again. He's like the monkey bomb in Black Ops. <laughs> Even the Halo of Flies get confused and stay with him. That's kind of funny. down this way. Can you die, please? Jeez. One of you are down. It's going to make this a lot easier. Thank you. Focus on 
this one. As that one sneakily tries to come up behind me. I don't think so, buddy. Nice try, though. I admire your perseverance. Three heads a lot easier than they used to. Oh, I was hoping for the sun card, but the Hierophon will do just nicely to your spare hearts one. Oh! A use for all of the coins, perhaps. Now, Judgment, if you could be a bro and give me some hearts, I would be very, very happy. Okay, or you could just give me a health upgrade. It's completely in your own choice. Okay, so you can get spirit hearts from that, as well as tarot cards and trinkets. And we can get red hearts from our three-headed man, so this might take a little while, however. Because I definitely want me some... Definitely want me some uh, more hearts, please. I'll pick it up, because like I said, oh yes, uh, pick it up, because one, I don't have another trinket, and two, I need to pick up everything, at least one. I'm feeling more confident. If I could get back up to full health in this room, it'd be incredible. It'd be absolutely incredible. You know what? Just so I don't get tempted. I'm just going to blow you up. And it'll give me some more cards. That's it. We'll uh, play you one more time. We'll blow you up. Oh, damn, I didn't want to play you again. Oh, well, that's fine. Oh, Troll Bomb! Not fine. Oh, that was close. Okay, got the world card. Pick up Isaac's fork, it gives you life steal. Oh damn it, didn't want to use a coin. Oh, cancer! That's definitely better than the Isaac's fork. Actually, I'm not sure in this situation, however, right, we'll use the moon. Pick up Isaac's fork. Use the moon card. Takes me to the secret room. And then I get to fight Greed. Thank you. Thanks, a bunch. Just just what I wanted. Fight greed. And I've just got my health back. And I've got near zero damage of DPS at the moment. My god. That's a terrible dodge. That, that not so much. Damn it. Greed, you managed to guess where I was going. You clever bro. Oh my god, that was too close. This fight is almost done with. There we go. Oh, Steam Sale. Thank you. That could actually be quite useful. And another Spirit Heart. Thank you. That room was actually quite good indeed. I don't trust that they're coming around there. Okay. The uh, best friend I am ready. Oh, damn it, I don't have any bombs. I'd love to just bomb my way out of this room. But then again, this room's not exactly hard. You just stand well away from them. And let them sort of get fired upon. And plus, if you just stand here, I'm pretty sure they can't hit you anyway. So yeah, this room's actually really easy. I don't know why I was panicking. You just die, Sir Greenhead. Greenhead, thank you. Oh, and now you give me a bomb. Thanks a bunch. You obviously heard my pleas. And that compass is really going to help me if, if I get to the moon. Because in a place where there's no item rooms or anything like that, it'd be lovely just to see where we're going. Lovely. Okay. The floor is pretty much done with now as well. Uh, gone to pretty much every single room that we could have wanted to. Ah! Damn it, that was terrible damage. I don't know why I just sort of sat there and took it. Took it like a man. God. This damage, it's easy for you to take. 
Just eat it up. Nom 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 nom. I wonder how long this video has been going on for, Jesus. Especially since we're only on the catacombs. Okay. Carrying me is easier than it could have been with the set of items that I've got. I wonder if she eat the best friend. Ow. The answer is yes. Sort of semi didn't expect that. And the reason it's going to be easier is because usually you have to hit her in the tail. But this time you can just have her sort of run at you. Do damage anyway. Oh, damn it! Speaking of damage, I forgot that she's got poison poop lag. Her poop, poison lag poop. No, I forgot that she has a poison poop. Which definitely restricts it. Spawns back as well. Got self replicating poop. You should market that. You get a great, great market for self replicating poop. I don't know what you can use it for. I don't know. Fertilizer? Hey, you can use self replicating poop for fertilizer. People would love it. Just don't like, make too much of it. Because otherwise it will self replicate. Cover the world and eventually it will be taken over by dung beetles. That's not something. That I quite fancy. I don't want to be ruled by dung beetles. A bit, a bit of a strange concept, don't you think? Oh, what did you do today? I was ruled by the dung beetles. Yeah, shot speed up, kind of good. Sort of, uh, sort of don't need it when you've got the uh, laser technology too. That's what I was looking for. That's the word I was looking for. Tech too. Okay, so we want to go down. Take out these fly boys. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Oh my god. They've got a lot of HP or I'm not doing much damage. Oh wait, of course it's the latter of the two. I am not doing much damage. At all. Really not doing much damage. Okay, Larry Jr. should be No problem at all. Either Lara Jr. has gotten faster or I'm just really slow. Oh wait, I'm really slow and I've got low damage. Only a real damage upgrade like in the day that we've had, like it's not even a straight up damage upgrade, it just depends on the way you use it, is Tech 2. That's the only... Oh great, the Hourglass. Pick it up just because it's... No, it's not better than Best Friend. Ugh. Okay, so I would say that let's go to the shop, but I actually can't be bothered. Let's just go to the boss fight. Okay, fistula here. Should be easy. What can you fight on depths part one? I'm actually, not sure. You know what would really suck? Horseman of the Apocalypse, just saying. Control engine, stay clear of... Just leave me alone, okay? Give me a break. Give me a pretty poopy run at the moment. Although, actually, I'm, I'm guessing that some people would say this run is actually pretty good. I mean, Tech 2, uh, hell of a lot of health, as long as you don't spend it all in the arcades, on the blood banks. You spend spending all your health on the blood banks again, what have I told you about that? I'm sorry, Mom. Well, actually, we should go to the shop, I'm just thinking, we should go to the shop because there's a mini boss at the left there, so... Greed can't be in there. Neither can Super Greed. So, it'd be sort of stupid of me not to go to the shop. Because probably next round it's going to be Super Greed. So, yeah. Just bear with me here. Just got to do a little bit of backtracking after this, but hey. Isaac's Fork. Where is my lifesteal, bro? I'm pretty sure that's what you do. I'm almost certain that Isaac's Fork gives you lifesteal. But I could be wrong. I'm pretty sure I'm not wrong, but I could be. Okay. Leapers. Not really cool. By my standards, I don't like leapers. Uh, they do exact. Oh my god, bullet hell. They have. Ah, uh, bullet hell. They've got a similar. Ah, uh, damn it. Firing system, as in the cross to the uh, red dudes. And they are like. Seriously hard for me to dodge for some reason. There we go. Crawl bomb. Make me want 
pick up that chest, but I'll go in here instead and pick up the chest anyway. So, look, it, I, it's brilliant that we uh, got Mum's purse as well. Just that, I mean the Steam sale. Mm. Silly bit. Uh, red patch, you know what, since I've got room for two trinkets, we might as well. I believe it gives you more red hearts, but once again I could be wrong. I, I apologise if this video goes over an hour. If this video goes over an hour, you can play out a genius if you stay for this long. Absolute genius. I love you. Love you for the rest of your life. And then, if you died before I did, I'd love you for the rest of my life. And I'd be like, man, that guy, he stayed all the way for the whole hour. Well, he was a true fan. And that's the way it goes. Forever. I really would. You think I'm joking, don't you? You would be wrong. It would be so, so mistaken. We're nearly there now. Nearly. I swear, I, if I don't get a damage upgrade this entire uh, run, it would be insane. It would actually be stupidly insane. Please be like the small rock in there. No. Okay. Something I can't get into. Thanks a bunch. So you you want you want to uh... all right just jump on top of that. Thank you. Wow! I'm sure he jumped on top of it, but then he jumped straight off of it afterwards. It's ridiculous. And why am I red? Sorry, I just saw that. What item could I have possibly got to have made me go this red complexion? caused me to undergo this metamorphosis, and my god, I hate enemies that's firing lasers. Alright, let's just get on the stroke 2 into his pan. It takes so much easier. Wow, this is a tedious boss fight. That's the only thing, it's... It's not even difficult anymore, like at, at the very beginning just then. I was finding it kind of hard. But at this point, it's just sort of tedious. Alright, right, we're nearly done here. Oh my gosh. Right, there we go. Monstro 2. Done with. Thanks for the range upgrade. That is actually just what I want. That is exactly what I needed. I needed a range upgrade just then. My range was so terrible I could only shoot across the entirety of the map. I mean, that's not far enough at all. I, I just needed that range upgrade so badly right now. Damn it. Why you do this to me, game? Look at how much... Oh my god, look at how much damage I'm not doing. So much right now. Would have loved a better chain reaction than that, but hey. Oh my god. Why am I doing so little damage? Did my damage upgrade answer. I haven't had any. Okay, this is gonna be an easy run, sort of. My halo fly should really protect me. Most of the enemies say, you know what, Guardian Angel. Well, that would have been pretty good. Uh, because Guardian Angel makes your familiars rotate like two times quicker. And that would have just been intensely awesome. Okay. Oh, we don't have any keys. Jesus Christ. Didn't realize that we didn't have any keys. Things are not looking up. Not looking up at all. Set me thinking about it, we could have got nine lives, um, and then done the nine lives glitch, but that's sort of cheap. The, uh, if you don't know, nine lives glitch, you die in a boss fight, respawn, kill yourself after you've beaten the boss. Don't pick up, no, do you pick up the treasure? 
Yeah, you pick up the treasure, kill yourself in the boss room with like a bomb or something, respawn outside it, face the boss again, and there's something crawling on my real life leg. <laughs> Spider, get off me! I don't want to, you're laughing so That's a little bit weird, Spider. I know. Well, do you like it? Get off me. Um, yeah, I can't remember what I was doing Oh, great. Terrible room. There's something inside it that I can't open. And these guys have got some pretty intense health. Mother of God. At least I've got the range to sustain. This is good. Sort of. These guys have got intense firepower. I'm not even. I'm not even joking. These guys' fire paths are intense. Oh, Jesus. Sorry, Lord. I don't, I don't even believe in Jesus. Sorry, I'm not religious. Does that make you wonder? <laughs> what? Wonder about what? Oh, my God, about these brain dudes have got some intense health. <coughs> Especially that one. I bet that one's got some real intense health. Rage would have been a really good item as well. Rage. I'm so angry! I am kind of angry about this run. Yes, key. Brilliant. Yeah, I'm kind of angry about this run and the fact that I haven't got any damage upgrades. This is insane. I'm actually really surprised that I've made it this far with no damage up. My health has sort of been carrying me the whole way. My health and my laser. Ugh. Nearly there. Right. What have we got? Chocolate and milk. I wonder. Does that affect my laser? I don't think it does. Unfortunately. No, it actually doesn't affect my laser. All I've done is given myself super powerful. This is like another not quite damage upgrade. Jesus. Why are you doing this to me? It's not cool. It's not cool at all. The game just don't like me right now. It's just like, tch, let you do well. You've done well for two runs in a row. To let you do well again. <sighs> okay. That is incredibly close right there. There we go. Alright, let's fight Mom. Okay, there apparently. Right, it actually did some damage on mom. Surprisingly. And I'm, I am actually genuinely surprised at the fact it's damaged mom. But yeah, if we win this boss fight, one, it's gonna take an incredibly long time. Two, I'd actually be semi surprised. Just take out that I was used guy. So I think we'll time our chocolate milk shots so that I do them when mum's foot comes down. So that I'm doing maximum damage. Maybe I'll just whatever I can. Okay, we're about a quarter of the way in. Fail of the chocolate milk. Nearly done by now. Oh, right, wrong way. Come on. I'm actually trying. Sorry for the lack of verbal commentary at the moment. I'm genuinely trying to concentrate here. This is hard. Ouch. Oh, yeah, man. No poison touch and the shadows combo. So help me out as well. That would be nice. Telling you all the things that I love in Isaac and what I haven't got in this game. 
Stop it. Bad. If I could get a damage up from this game. Oh, damn it. Got three hearts left now. Period. War two hearts. Period of war. We did it. Oh yeah, another range upgrade. Brilliant. Well, once again, exactly what I wanted. Thank you. Thank you again. You're not you're not trolling me at all. You're just like, yeah, get all the range upgrades. You absolutely need them. Though I don't know why I'm red. What is this red all about? Anyway, so three hearts, base damage, the wound. Thoughts on success? Zero. Genuinely. Oh yay! My favorite, favorite, favorite enemies in the entire game. I love fighting these guys. I never lose against them. Ever. <laughs> They're not overpowered at all. Oh, that's just... Hope to God. I'll pray. Dear Lord, allow me to complete this eyes up run. At least, at least allow me to get through this fateful room. Thank you. And look, there was that life. Oh my god, that's been the first bit of life steal from this goddamn trinket. Thanks a bunch, uh, Isaac Swarm. You've done, you've done me some great, great help throughout this run. Genuinely, you you really have. I'm so so grateful. I'm not angry at you in the slightest for not doing your job. These guys are just annoying. You just stay still, thank you. Okay, so we've gone to about the same distance as last run. I believe, so I'm happy. Same distance as last run, that's cool in my eyes. Oh look, another piece of life still. Now you're starting to work. Maybe it only does it when you're in like under two hearts or something. I don't know. I'm trying to think up reasons why it couldn't have been. Why it hasn't? Oh really? For God's sake. Well, we can get hit once. Anything can kill us. Safe from anything. I've got base damage. Give me something good, please. My first pill of the game. And it was ranged down! Oh no. Now I can only fire across the entire screen still. Shame. That that's that was the game breaker right there. That that range down pill. That's the reason why we're going to lose. And if we don't lose this, I am I'm gonna be very, very happy. To say the least. But to do the wound and only get hit one more time, if we get no more health, but to only get hit one more time, that'd be incredible. Oh yay, money that I definitely now cannot use. I've got a feeling that it's this way. I was correct. Not often that that happens. Chain reaction, please. Destroy everything in this room. Well, near enough. Still got these burrows. These guys are relatively easy compared to what we faced up against. If I took damage against them now, I'd be eating my words. Oh, two chests. Yes, a bit of health. Still can only take two bits of damage, but hey, let's fight the boss. Oh yeah, after, this, after facing off against Diglets and my worst nemesis, which I presume is plural for nemesis. I hope. Diglets are annoying. Anything that burrows into the ground can go and die in a hole. And they've got health. Like, they have got serious health. 
Like me at the moment, I've got health issues. These guys can wait opposite. There's two of them down, fortunately. Good. Meat bag is done with. Totally for I keep on forgetting about my chocolate milk shop. There we go. Okay, a little bit more life steal, that's good. Can now get hit two times. Uh, and we're gonna hit, get hit much more than two times against the bloat. Okay, so that pretty much did as much damage as the tick would do. Oh god, we're so dead. We're so screwed. Yep, there we go. Thanks for watching guys. Got to the utero again. Hopefully one day we'll get further than that. I believe. I believe. I believe that we can. So yeah, thanks for watching. If you watch all the way through, you're an absolute G. Uh, if you didn't, I can understand why this was an hour long and you're not even listening to this. So anyway, peace out. This has been Western Links.